up, YouTube? It's Randy coming back at you with another corporate craft beer review. I'm here with my man JJD, Freddie Rodriguez, Gil Mello. We're here in Boston for Extreme Beer Fest uh, 2017. Um, we're about to review another beer for you guys, but um, before we do it, we want to let our Eric Wood from uh, Blackboard, Blackboard, Blackboard Beer Reviews know that, um, man, we, uh, we're Coming with you. you bro. We I'm love you. We're thinking of you. Yeah. Love you, man. Um, craft craft right. Beer Nation loves you. We respect you. We're, we're, we're right, right there with you. We're pulling for you. And, um, you know, if we if we can help you in any way, man, just reach out yeah, to us. Out, Let man. us know. We got sure. you, bro. You're not first, man. Um, so that said, uh, I feel kind of shitty going into a review off of that. But nonetheless, um, we're checking out Bottle Logic's Fundamental Observation. Observation. This is batch number two. This is their uh, Imperial Vanilla Stout brewed with uh, Madagascar vanilla beans and aged in bourbon barrels. So that said, let's open it up. Oh, ABV. This bad boy clocks in at 14. 14%. Oh, yeah. 14. Yeah. Not, not for the faint of heart. Percent. No. So, That's a session so, beer for Rennie, yeah. just so you guys know. Mow that lawn. Put your clothes on. Yeah. Put, put, your, put your big boy pants on when you're drinking this bad boy. Cheers. Guys, what is that? What does that nose remind well, you guys I mean, of? Does it, does it remind does you of it anything? Look like it? Looks good. I it think like it looks good. DGM. Looks like a big, big DGM ass like stout. A, not me. Like a star, my, my DGM looks like a starry night in the summer. <laughs> <laughs> Holy crap. Starry, This is like the Milky Way in your glass. Yeah. Hell yeah. We're going to have some stained teeth tonight. Yeah. I we already that. do. Yeah, <laughs> like 12 beers in. Yeah. yeah. So I'm, smells, so, smells good, though. Vanilla. I get a lot I of vanilla. I get pretty big That's vanilla. Do you, you get big vanilla? Yeah, I get a lot of vanilla. I get myself. big barrel and faint vanilla. I, I, I get the vanilla, but I get faint vanilla I, as it relates to the it barrel. It might be a combo for me, dude. I'm getting I'm getting barrel, but I'm getting a lot of vanilla. I think it has to do with the, the, the oak, oak, oak aroma kind of a... It accentuates it, maybe? Like, it has that vanilla kind of tone to, yeah. to yeah. the oak as well. So it's, yeah. I, I, I'm trying to figure out like the what I'm getting. Like the it is the oak age it, or it is the vanilla. Uh, but I do get a little, a little, a little bit of the sweetness. So I, I think the vanilla is there for me at least on, on the nose. You get, I get a little roasty quality to it too. And I think they use like Madagascar I'm, vanilla, I'm, I'm which like, they like, really like stuff like too. I'm getting that barrel char. I think that's what I'm getting. I get a tiny bit of bourbon too. Yeah. You, get, you get barrel. You get you know a little bit of vanilla oak. You get vanilla bourbon, but you, and you get the beans yeah. as well. Yeah, I think it smells delicious. It's almost like that. That's the kind of beer you want to drink a little warmer than you would have most stouts yeah. too. Yeah. Yeah, I, I, I don't want a cold stout, dude. For sure, never. This let's is, try this thing, man. Yeah, let's give it a taste, guys. Cheers, bro. Cheers, cheers, guys. CBN. Mmm. Oh my. Yeah, that's good. Wow. Yeah. A lot more vanilla. Stone the crows. Christ on a bike. Shout out to Simon. Real ill crappy you got, reviews. You, yeah. yeah. We could use all, all those. Uh, Whole, good, good, as my brother would say, good googly moogly. <laughs> this is legit. Yep. Uh, people people are hyped up like hell over FO. Over I, FO. I, I get it. I get it. Yeah. I get it. I get it. I understand it. The hype is deserved. Um, I got I to gotta, I gotta really like think about this here because... That's a, that that's, that's same thing. It's like, very like complex because you you keep getting after flavors after you drink it. It's kind of like it's the medium mouthfeel again, but this. Jeffrey's about finished with his. Yeah, it's I don't play, man. You know I don't play, man. Man, but I got I got to analyze it. The you know? complexity is off mm -hmm. the charts. But, but I'm I'm, I'm kind of I'm kind of with Gil. You get sort of like there's four or five layers of flavor. Yeah. I mean, yeah. you get bourbon, you get vanilla, you get like, like more oak char, vanilla, yeah. then a little bit of roast. I mean, so it's it's pretty cool that way. That's that's, that's a lot of after flavor. Yeah, it develops a lot. Yeah, definitely. It just lingers for 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 a bit. That's awesome. I would I would say the body's a little light. Can we get sponsored by like Chapstick or somebody? Because we've been lip smacking. I'm <laughs> yeah. telling you, man. We, I want to get sponsored by Burt's. <laughs> yeah, Burt's Bees. Bees. Yeah. Holy shit. Jeffrey, <laughs> how would you rate this? I, I mean, I think it's a very good beer. I mean, I love the complexity. I love that there's like several layers of flavor. Um, I'm looking for a little more body. Um, I love the vanilla. I'm, I mean, vanilla is one of my kind of favorite adjuncts. So I'm, I'm getting it. I got it in the nose. I'm getting it big in the flavor. Um, I love that. I love 
I'm, I'm going to say 4.0. 4. 4.0 CBN caps. The main thing for me would be body. I would look for a little more, a little more viscosity here. Frio. Um, I'm pretty set in stone on four and a half. I'm serious. I've enjoyed Space Trace. I, I think Bottle Logic is one of those breweries, right? Like, they, they, you can, like you said, like you understand the hype, like or the talk, the want for this beer. You have FO and you're getting it. Yeah. You're getting the, the like you said, you're getting the. the the, the barrel, you're getting that bourbon, you're getting the fucking vanilla in there. I, again, as you've watched many of my stout reviews, I'm always like, yeah, it lacks body. Yeah, it's medium. However, in complexity, like what it loses in the body for me as point wise, it's gonna gain for what it brings. Yep, that's fair. Yeah, that's fair. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. like, let's say it's a four to five, and then that flavor just keeps developing yeah. and changes, and it's right back at four and a half for me. Um, could I. Could they change this? I wouldn't want it to change. Like if, I, I just, I, 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 lo- I like this beer, and I'm giving yeah. it four and a half just because the body. I think, and I think, I don't know. It's, it's. I, I'm toying with the, the even the four, like four seven five. I'm like so close. Like I'm in between to be honest. Four and a half and four seven five yep. vanilla. Yep, yep. Because I don't want it to be like cloning, like almost like artificial. <clears throat> yeah. It's it's money to me, dude. Like this is one of those when you drink such. We've been drinking. Fucking awesome beers tonight. Like, great beers, right? Yep. And, and after a while, you're like, it's hard to dissect it. Well, you know what I mean? Like that's why I think people say like scoring is kind of hard. And I, I think it's a testament to how good the beer is after the, the kind of beers we had it tonight, yeah. and this beer yeah. is still standing yeah. out. Yeah. We're not drain pouring it. Yeah, it's, it's no. solid. Yeah. So I, I have to say, I, there's more information in this label than a lot of the electronics I've bought lately. <laughs> There's That's some, a there's, lot there's, of the information. There's more info on the label than there's on some other craft brewery websites yeah. about the beer. I'm I'm gonna say that for me this is four point seven five. Wow. And yeah. there are zero things that I would change about this beer. Um, the only reason why I wouldn't give it a five is because if if it had a just a hair more viscosity, yeah. this would be a five beer. Um, you go on a flavor journey with this beer. I mean, yeah. on the nose, the nose. I think you, you can readily identify the flavors on the nose. But on the palate, it this beer shifts from the front of your palate to the middle to, to the middle of your palate to the back of your palate. It takes you on that little it, journey. It, it's sure. a journey. It yeah. provides so much depth and complexity that cannot be dismissed in this beer. Yeah. Um, this is a fantastic beer. I wouldn't change anything about it. 4.75 CBN cap. Right I'm surprised you guys talking about the body because the body doesn't bother me at all in this beer. I think it's... Awesome, uh, the beer. I'm a lot of after flavor. It just it's a it, it's kind of the keeps giving. I love it. Uh, it will be four yeah. seven five for me. Let yeah. me take that back. I'm giving this beer a five. You give me five. This is a five. Now I'm gonna stick on a four seventy five. Yeah, the awesome. nose lacked a little bit for me, but this I've, had, I've had ten percent yeah, beers that yeah, taste I've, way boozy. Yeah. Yeah. I've had eight percent beers that yeah. taste boozy. Yeah. Yeah. This is a four seventy five and a smidgen. Yeah, and a smidgen. Five, yeah. And a smidgen. I, 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 I agree with that because I got, I, I'm right there. That's what I'm saying. I'm right there, like four and a half, four seven five for me. Yeah. yeah. That, I'm that, like like four eight five. That's the first whatever, four point eight three we've ever whatever, had. Whatever anyway. you guys are doing at the bottle logic, that yeah, it's that good. Freaking keep, keep awesome doing it, beer. Keep doing it. Yeah. So guys, there you have it. This is part of the bottle logic stasis project. This is their fundamental yeah. observation. Their um, imperial vanilla stout. Blended with uh, Madagascar vanilla beans, Asian bourbon barrels, um, excellent. An array of flavors, an array of ratings because my, this beer, like eighty years old, this Yannick beer, this beer yeah. provides something for everybody. If you like stouts, the, yeah. Sure. If you don't like it, the person sitting right next to you is gonna love, love it. it. Yeah. yeah. So, so give it to me. Yeah. So cheers. Cheers, cheers guys. Cheers.